Taking a closer look at some day trip ideas for seniors, we are joined this morning by Happier at Home President uh, Marie Rodriguez. Marie, good morning to you. Good morning. How are you? I'm doing well. It's good to see you again. Um, all right, let's, let's talk about these day trips. And first, why are trips like this uh, important for seniors? Yeah, so there's many different senior centers and YMCA programs that offer um, programs geared towards seniors. And these are super important to make sure that we're keeping up with so social interaction, being active and really remaining out of our homes to be able to go into the community and be involved with programs like this with other people. All right, let's talk about the different offerings because uh, one of the one of the top spots I think for a lot of seniors are our senior centers um, and those offer a variety of activities if you if you want to get out for the day. Yeah, so they offer different. There's um, a section that offers classes. There's a section that offers day trips, like you mentioned. Um, I know searching on the town of Gates, they're going to Del Lago, um, Buffalo Botanical Gardens. There's different lunch outings that they can participate in. Um, also Corning Museum of Glass. But then they also offer classes such as um, chair exercises, fitness classes, scrapbooking, um, technology classes for you know seniors to learn their cell phone or those types of things, FaceTime. Um, and then they also have groups, Euchre, Bridge, mm. um, different groups where people can join in and play and, and be involved in their community. Yeah, we talk about staying engaged as we get older. Uh, another opportunity to that uh, for that is education and there are a lot of offerings there as well. Yes, yeah, so many different classes, um, like I mentioned, with people just being engaged, and I know technology is a big one, um, and also the um, senior centers throughout the town, even the YMCAs we're very involved in. Um, for example, tomorrow, Happier at Home has collaborated with um, the Legacy Willow Pond Independent Community, so myself and our business support managers and the executive director and sales director, Jeff and Susie at Willow Pond, we will be presenting at the YMCA, and then we also do um, something fun. It's called the Jeopardy Roadshow. Mm -hmm. So we go around to different communities and different centers and bring prizes and things, and it's, it's really well received. I was gonna say, what's the, the benefit for seniors and what's the reception? Yeah, so the reception has been great, especially now that things are opening up with COVID and people are starting to get back out in the community. Um, it's it's a great group of people that even um, people that are widows or just going out with their friends, things like that. Um, it's really nice to be able to be out there and, and with people. Yeah, especially now that we're kind of easing out of this pandemic, a lot of people looking to get back to uh, engaging with each other and seeing each other out and about. Marie, good to see you. Thank you so much for your time this morning. Have a great day. You